Mayor Septimo. I'm from Camarines Sur, Philippines, and currently based here in the Middle East, serving as lay missionary of Campus for Christ and also regional coordinator for YFC Middle East. I've been part of the community for around 24 years. It's more than half of my life. I started in KFC, then YFC, then SFC, and now I've been a full-time pastor worker, a lay missionary of CFC for 13 years. I was introduced to Compass for Christ through my parents. They attended the CFC Christian Life Program in 1996, and they became active members of the community. One day, I noticed that there were lots of gatherings in our house. There were prayer meetings, uh, Bible studies, choir practices, music ministry practices, and lots of fellowships. Then I noticed that we also started to have our family rosary every night. And my parents told us that it's because of Copos for Christ. On weekends, uh, my parents would brought us to CFC assemblies and met other CFC families and kids. And that's where we started to uh, join, uh, my siblings and I join Kids for Christ. And then one day, uh, my father told me that I would be attending the YFC youth camp together with my brother. And so we did. And after that camp, we became active members of Youth for Christ. My parents brought CFC into our home and ensured that we had God and CFC in our lives. In 2005, I served as a YFC provincial youth head in Camp Sur. And then our regional coordinator, full-time worker during the time, invited me to be a mission volunteer. And that's where I started working as part-time in Compass for Christ Provincial Mission Center while studying. And in 2009, a year after uh, my college graduation, our regional coordinator invited me again to be a YFC full-time pastor worker. I knew that this was a bigger call from the Lord. And so I prayed, discerned, and said yes. So in June 2009, that's exactly 13 years ago, uh, I went to CFC Global Mission Center in Ortigas and trained to be a YFC full-time pastor worker. My yes to all the invitations to work in CFC and serve God it's all about the blessings my family and I receive. It's all about gratitude uh, to the Lord and to the community for molding my family and me to become good Christians. In my 13 years as a lay missionary of COC, I experienced many challenges uh, from being away from my family, feeling homesick, sometimes plans don't work the way you wanted them, uh, there are moments of feeling unappreciated and rejection. Uh, there were moments of spiritual dryness, uh, mental, emotional, and physical fatigue because of the workloads and all the travels and meeting with different people. Uh, the life of a missionary is often at stake because of all the travels especially going to unfamiliar territories alone and dealing with different culture, uh, people, and food. Uh, there was a time that I was stranded in Calcutta, India because my visa to my next country to, be, to, to visit got denied. So I needed to extend my stay there for several days alone. And there was no CFC active in that area. It was challenging because of the different people, different culture, and the food and the language. When COVID-19 pandemic started in 2020, I was stranded in Oman for five months. And I was anxious during that time because borders were closed, airports were closed. Uh, I was worried about my family, about my welfare, but I was also grateful to God because of the CFC families who welcomed me into their homes. I knew these challenges were part of my yes as a lay missionary of Compass for Christ. And most of these challenges uh, taught me to see God working and performing great things 
miracles in my life. And sometimes these situations were turned into blessings. Indeed, uh, working in COC as a lay missionary is a great adventure with the Lord. And in my missionary journey, uh, there were also many blessings. I've seen how the Lord blessed and transformed my family into a Christian family praying and serving in the community. Working uh, in CFC helped me to grow in my character, in my faith, and in my relationship with God. I gained many experiences and skills, and the countless people I've encountered while working in CFC and doing God's missions were big blessings to me. They became my friends, my second family, my home. And I'm always grateful to God for sending the best people uh, for me to serve with. In my 13 years working as a lay missionary, uh, it's all about God's grace. I endured, persevered, and stayed because of God, because of His call, because of His will, and my relationship with Him. He guided and equipped me in my journey. My co-missionaries, uh, the CFCs, SFCs, and YFCs I've encountered in my mission area uh, were also an inspiration to me in working uh, in CFC. Seeing people transformed and empowered to be the best individuals for the Lord inspired me and developed self, uh, self-fulfillment and desire uh, for me to serve and touch people's lives more and more. Every day, I'm grateful to God for calling me to work to serve in CFC as a lay missionary. My yes to God's mission is the best decision in my life. Despite of all the challenges and knowing that God is with me and I'm not alone, God is bringing peace, joy, and hope in my life. Amen.